Hi guys, uh, November 16, 2018. It's 11.43 p.m. on the East Coast, so for you guys out in California, it is 8.43 p.m. I suggest that you click on the link below. Take a look at the next red site. The reason why I'm doing it like this is because something is really wrong with my computer now. I cannot get my capture program working. I couldn't get any program working. I couldn't get into my Gmail. I had to reboot and I still can't get my capture program working. But it's important enough for me to do it like this. I hope you clicked on the link and you're looking at it as you're listening to me. I wish I could tell you what the consequences are of what you are seeing, I can't. I can tell you it's not good. What we're looking at is what we were looking at in Houston for about two weeks running 24-7. Now, we know it's been documented. I've posted videos on these extremely low frequencies and it is not just that they can cause earthquakes. When you see this in California, yes. It's very concerning. They can also use these extremely low frequencies to control the minds. Yes, it is true. But they can control a whole region of, a whole region, the population in a region, with these extremely low frequencies. They can make them, make the population very depressed, angry, anxious, feeling sick, all sorts of symptoms. Never have I seen it like this. Never. I have never seen these frequencies shooting off so powerfully, intensely in California. And if anybody posts a video, if suddenly you get this earthquake swarm and they don't mention these frequencies, they only mention the oil drilling or the fracking or volcanoes, sorry. These frequencies have to be <laughs> factored in. But if you take a look at the southern states, North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, Alabama, Mississippi, and the panhandle of Florida. Well, are they just using the radar to look for planes only in that region of the country? Nowhere else? We are living a very dangerous time. Many know it. I had to post this. But let me just take a minute to ask if anybody knows, if anybody has experienced on their browser an error message in pink that includes your icon. The icon for me is the picture of the dog that I have on Never Lose, no, on, um, well, it was on Kafka Winston World. But I have an error message and it says, sync isn't working. I've never experienced this. And then it says, confirm sync settings to start sync, open settings. Frankly, I'm now afraid to do anything on my computer because in the past couple of days something really has been happening that has been so slowing it down, programs not working, I can't get into Gmail very often, having to reboot over and over again and I lost an entire file of videos.
a lot of videos. A lot of videos that I had not um, saved that were posted on YouTube. And hundreds of videos of the sky here, all gone. And videos that I was working on that I had saved in my editing program regarding geoengineering, weather modification, the very low clouds that we are having now, artificial clouds, and the new naming, the new discovery of like nine or eleven clouds, new discovery by NASA, and it's bullshit because these are the clouds that are being produced via the geoengineering and the frequencies and it's all gone. So yeah, I've been experiencing a lot of frustration. But please do click on the link below if you have not yet because something is happening in California. Something more than what is happening to you guys. We are at war. There is no denying that fact. Frequencies are being used as a weapon. So when you see all of these, what look like laser beams, could be extremely low frequencies being set off. Set off still in Texas. California, like never before, um, just on the border of Nevada and California, going into Nevada, Florida, and going right through my area. Frequencies being set off in North Carolina into Virginia. There's an awful lot happening. So, if anybody knows anything about this sync problem that I'm having, the error message, please leave a comment below. I'd really like to get my capture program working again. Stay safe, everybody.